Welcome to the world of Microsoft Windows 95. With Windows 95, you'll unlock the potential of personal computing so you can work easier and faster. You'll explore exciting new possibilities and even have fun doing it. Windows 95 is designed to make using your computer easier, whether you're at work, at home, or on the road. It has a rich set of features giving you multiple ways to do the same task, to accommodate any level of expertise. In this demonstration, some of the basic features of Windows 95 are demonstrated automatically, and others you can try yourself. Just follow the pointers when they appear, and proceed as directed in the text. To advance the demo, click the Next button when it flashes. We recommend that you choose Quick Tour first. It takes about eight minutes. The time has come to travel beyond Windows 3.1 and MS-DOS into the world of Microsoft Windows 95. Here you'll discover powerful features that let you do things you've never done with your computer before and make all your everyday tasks easier, faster, even more fun. To see what Windows 95 can do, here's a great place to start. Windows 95 makes working with your computer easier. For example, let's see how much easier and faster it is to open or find programs and documents. We'll begin at the Start button. It's at the lower left corner of the screen. It's always available, so you can use it anytime. To open a program, click the Start button. Move the mouse up to Programs, then over and down to Microsoft Word and click again. That's all it takes to open a program. Windows 3.1 Program Manager is gone, but all your program groups are still there, and they're easier to reach. Here you see the new version of Microsoft Word for Windows 95. You'll also find that Windows 95 does a great job supporting your existing Windows and MS-DOS programs. Closing a program is simple. Just click the X in the upper right-hand corner. Windows 95 reduces the number of steps to get things done, so you get all of your work done faster. Suppose you were working on a graphic, but can't remember where you saved it on your hard drive. Let's see how easy it is to locate and open it. First, click on the Start button. Then choose Documents, and you see the list of documents you worked on most recently. Move the mouse over and down to Cup, and click. You don't need to search through Program Manager or File Manager anymore. With Windows 95, you just located and opened a document with only two mouse clicks. Whenever you open a program, document, or window, a button representing it appears on the taskbar, the gray bar at the bottom of the screen. The taskbar buttons show which programs you have opened, making it easier to switch among them. Now let's minimize this document to the taskbar by clicking the box near the upper right-hand corner. Minimizing is a great way to manage all your open programs. Suppose you want to find a document, but you can't recall its name or which folder it's in. All you remember is that the word coffee appears in it somewhere. Here's an easy way to find it. Click on Start. Move the mouse up to Find, then over to Files or Folders, and click. Here we'll enter the word Coffee for you. Click Find Now, 
and you get a list of all the files that contain the word coffee within the text of the document, including the one you wanted. To open it, just double click on Open House Flyer. Now, let's minimize it so we can access it later from the taskbar. Just click the Minimize box. No matter where you store your files or programs, with Windows 95, it's easy to access them quickly. You'll find switching between programs is easier than ever, since the taskbar never leaves the screen. Let's see how switching works. On the taskbar, click on the Microsoft Word button. Next, click the Cup Paint button on the taskbar. This way, it's easy to switch between as many programs as you have open. Go ahead and try it. When you're ready to move on, click the Next button. One of the biggest changes in Windows 95 is that now your Windows PC can handle multitasking even better. This means you can have multiple programs working simultaneously. For example, you can print one document while you copy another. You don't have to wait for one operation to finish before you start something else. Here, a document is being copied from one folder to another. Now click Next to see multitasking in action. While the copying proceeds, the open house flyer is being printed. With multitasking, you can get more things done at once. It's not a miracle. It's Windows 95. Windows 95 makes organizing your computer remarkably easy. Let's take a look at how the My Computer feature organizes things for you. Just double-click its icon in the upper left-hand corner. The My Computer window contains all of the drives on your computer, as well as Control Panel and Printer's folders. Now double-click on Robert's Drive. All the drive's files, folders, and programs appear in the window. Here you see another way Windows 95 improves your computing. Your file and folder names can be up to 250 characters long. Let's change an old DOS style name to a new, more descriptive one. You may never again have to open a file just to see what's in it. Using the right mouse button is another way to find out more about a file or folder, or reach a shortcut to common tasks. Click the right mouse button and you'll see a menu that gives you additional options. You can use the right mouse button on virtually any element within Windows 95, giving you a quick and easy shortcut to make you more efficient. Windows 95 gives you another way to view and work with your files, called the Windows Explorer. It's like Windows 3.1 File Manager, only better. In the Explorer, everything you work with on your computer, including floppy drives, hard drives, and network drives, appears in a single window. Here's how to reach it. From the Start menu, choose Programs. Then choose Windows Explorer and click. The Explorer makes it easy to reach virtually anything in your computing environment. Try clicking on the plus to the left of Robert's Drive. The Contents window shows you all of the folders on Robert's C Drive. Now it's much easier to copy files from one drive to another or download something from the network. No more tiling multiple windows. Think of the Explorer as a highly efficient way to manage your files and resources. Windows 95 gives you great new tools to personalize your computer. 
It's easy to customize your screen background. Try choosing a new one right now. Click on Start. Then move the mouse up to Settings. Now click Control Panel. Double click on the display icon in the Control Panel window. Browse through the wallpapers by clicking on their names. Click Apply to see your choice on the desktop. When you see the one you like, click OK. Here's how your wallpaper appears on the desktop. Click Next to continue and we'll change back to the original one for you. When you're not sure how to perform a task or you want to try some new things but don't know how, the new Help feature in Windows 95 will show you the way. Go ahead and try it. Click on the Start button. Move the mouse up to Help and click on it. For instance, to get help changing the date your computer displays, we enter the word date in the index. Now choose changing your computer's date. Click on display and you can read the topic right on the screen. Now you no longer need to open a help window and write everything down to remember it. Here you can hit the jump button and it takes you instantly to the topic or function you choose. Getting help is this easy whenever you need it. You've now completed the guided portion of the Windows 95 demonstration. Click Next to go to the menu. Then click on a topic to find out more about Windows 95.